so it's Valentine's Day. It's a day of love. And I'm single. And this is like exactly where I'm supposed to be. I know this. Like, I need a time to figure some things out. I need a time to heal through some things. Like, I want to get married. Lord knows I want a husband. But, like, I know that I have some stuff to work through. So, because it's Valentine's Day and I was, like, talking about a, um, this with a client yesterday. I was, like, I'm going to write a list of, like, future characteristics I want in a husband. Because, like, I've never done that before. Like, I know, like, certain things I want, but I've never, like, written it down. So, I thought it would be fun to go over my list. How iconic. Okay. Starting off strong. These are the real things that I want in a, a partner. And then I'll get into the looks. Like, the things that fade away, but they would be nice to have now. You know what I'm saying? So, first and foremost, God-fearing man, of course. I need a leader because I'm bossy, so you need to be able to put me in my place. A man that wants to provide because mama does not want to work like this forever. Like, I want to work for play money, and I want you to take care of me. Please come take care of me. Please. I'm begging. Um, somebody that's family-oriented. I want, like, some twins, some kids running around. I would love to be a stay-at-home mom. Somebody that's passionate, driven, motivated, like, knows what they want. They're going to go get it. Like, we can go do things together. We can, like, you know, build a life. I love that. Um, somebody that's loving, kind, affectionate, of course. Somebody that embraces my family. Okay. And now on the look side of things. Um, tall, dark, and handsome, please. I'm begging. Literally begging. Um, six foot and above. Like, six three would be so nice. I'm a tall. I'm five eight. Like, a man that could make me feel like a baby next to him, I'd be eating that up. I really would be. Um, okay. Handsome, of course. Like, give me a face. Like, a good face. Love that. Love that for me. Um, I would love some good hair. Give me a good hairline. Like, please. Like, a lineup. Like, if you can have a lineup we could be talking, you know what I'm saying? Like, give me some good hair. Um, nice teeth. I would love that. Um, I love to whiten my teeth. Like, we can whiten our teeth together. Like, if you're into that, you know what I mean? Like, I would love that. Um, also, like, a good sense of fashion, you know? Like, I'm not opposed to, like, dressing you. Like, I'm not opposed to giving you the vibes. Like, I would love to do that if you're willing, but, like, or if you just came with the vibes, that'd be cool, too. So, that was a list. Just some of the basics, if you will. Just the basics. Just, like, a perfect 10 out of 10 man. Just the basics. The bare minimum is perfection. Kidding, 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 kidding. As I'm working through my stuff and becoming who God wants me to be, I'm just praying that there's, he's preparing a good man for me because I would love to go skydiving with someone, you know? And that's another one. Adventurous. Please be adventurous. Like, I do not want to, like, just freaking hang out and watch a movie. <clears throat> I'm sick. I am sick. I want to go skydiving. I want to go bungee jumping. I want to sail across the ocean, possibly hike across the United States. Just, like, a few things. Like, please give me an adventurous spirit. Like, I do not want to be sitting in a house. Oh, I rebuke that in Jesus' name. Okay, bye, y'all.